Long time no see everyone, it's your old mate Jakargon, back at it again, this time unfortunately with another video with some bad news. So from the last video I had mentioned that my remotes had broken, I'd gotten fixed. Uh, they're actually doing okay, I've worn them a few times out, they're kicking along well. In fact, I'm wearing them right now, they're doing their thing, slowly falling apart, but I'm still happy that I'm getting wear out of them. I also mentioned that I wanted to get a more beta type pair that I could just wear to whatever because these ones that I have now I kind of really like how they look with the waxed look. So I was on marketplaces looking around each day as I do and I came across this pair that were about $250 Australian except they were located in Japan. I thought that they looked all right there weren't very many photos so I picked them up because there were a lot of people commenting on them saying that they were going to buy them at a reduced price very very soon i think the seller had said you know if no one buys them by x time then i will reduce it and then this person that had commented on them would be able to buy them so i figured hey that's not a bad price at all considering secondhand at least in australia you're looking at 500 plus so i snapped them up and was like okay cool it'll take a couple of weeks to get here we'll see how we go from there so then this package arrived today and i was a bit surprised and thinking, hey, look, it's a dark shadow box. I didn't think the thing was going to come boxed. I looked at the side and as you can see here, it has it listed as low tops, but also a sticker for high tops. And immediately my heart sunk. I was like, oh no, but maybe this is just a box and this is just what they decide to send them in. So open the box and we've got this kind of musty pair of high top Ramones. I look at them and I think, yeah, I, I guess these look like Ramones. Pull one out and look at it and immediately something feels a little bit off. The sole is really, really, really hard and like it, it just feels, it feels rock hard compared to my current ones. I actually should, I'll just do a comparison. So these are the current ones that I have. It's kind of a bit of like a damper sound. There's that ASMR just for you. And then the pair that arrived sound hard, like rock hard. And I'm looking and thinking like, this is, this is weird. Something feels weird about these. The zips are also YKK, which I looked into. And apparently there were a couple of seasons where Rick did use YKK zips on Ramones. So it was like, oh, okay, that doesn't really say too much more. But then I opened one of them up the insides are just kind of torn to pieces like these bit here for my pair at least they are double stitched whereas here the single stitch that seemed a bit weird but mainly it was the the eyelets look at these bad boys they look a bit weird and they're all like that all the way down i'm thinking this is this is worrisome <laughs> i checked the other one and looking at the the dark shadow thing on the inside you can't even see it properly it doesn't the tongue itself does not stretch out properly even loosening up the laces to show the tag on the inside it's just sewn incorrectly <laughs> just like this is this is real bad <laughs> this is a bad time so i also put the shoes on as well and they feel really tight these are a size 42 and felt snug on my feet, whereas my long running ones are a size 41 and feel big. So that that also felt like something was off. So I posted in the Rick Owens Reddit, they have a weekly legit checking thread where some of the moderators or also viewers can, viewers, readers can chime in and, you know, help you try and figure these kind of things out. Posted a few photos and within an hour, just like, they are fake. Ah. <sighs> can't catch a break these days but look like it's my own fault i did jump on something that seemed like a good deal at the time ran that risk and you know have gotten burned by it listen to how loud these are and, and, and walking around in these is just awful i wouldn't wish it on anyone unfortunately i have now spent money on a pair of replica shoes that I don't know what to do with. I think I'm going to try and sell them on, not to try and make any money, but mainly try and like gather some money back. I know that there is a market for these and when I post them, they will definitely be marked as replicas or 
alluding as much to it as possible. I know like Depop and stuff won't let you do that kind of stuff because they want everything to be real, even though, even though so many, so many, so many, so many, so many, so many, so many places do not do that on Depop and you get stuck with loads and loads of fake and replica items there. Thanks Depop. Anyhow, I know that there are people that do look for replica shoes because they don't want to spend the full price. So I will list these to start at the price that I bought them for and will accept offers. But I do want to try and pass them on to someone who will actually wear them. Oh yeah, it's just, just unlucky times. Unlucky times. I wanted to know as well, like, has this happened to any of you before? Have you found a good deal? It seems okay, but then you have to do the thing where you need to get it delivered and then you're kind of just let down. I mean, it's, it seems to be par for course with online buying and the risk you take, but it is just a shame when it happens. It really, really bums me out. Anyhow, I hope you all are doing well and I do want to make the next video a bit more positive. Uh, it's just feeling a bit like bummed out about this. Honestly, I mean, it's mainly just the money thing, really. I mean, taking a chance is fine, but when you're buying something from an online marketplace in another country, there's not much I can do here. The seller had five stars and it seemed like they were doing just fine. So who knows? Anyway. Whatever, we, we sleep on it and we get back on the horse, Master Wayne, after we have fallen off the horse. So yeah, thanks for watching. Hope you're all doing well, uh, getting vaccinated, wearing your masks, getting back outside. We are out of lockdown from tonight, actually. So a couple of cool videos in the works, in the planning. Love getting comments from all of you all, reading them, getting messages on Instagram as well. It's really, really fun to chat to everybody. I really do appreciate those who reach out and even ask questions as well. Uh, it's good to know and see the fits that y'all are coming up with. You're all super stylish and I am a little jealous, but we're on this journey together, aren't we? All right, so take care everyone. Be safe, be well, and as always, don't do anything I do, especially accidentally buying fake shoes off marketplaces. Bye-bye. <laughs>